Section D, first question. The probability distribution of a random variable x is as follow. P of x, now here 1, 2 and 3 equation is given and the value of x is given. Find the value of constant k where we have to find out the value of k and the probability of event that variable x assume even number. Okay, so first of all, first we'll keep the value of x that is 2, 3, 4. Here I'm making a tabular form. Then out of this equation, we'll solve the value and we'll keep in P of x that is probability distribution. Let's start. First, I'm taking the first equation that is P of x equals to x minus 1 where the x value once we'll solve with 2 and then we'll solve with 3. The first time keeping x value as 2 that is the k 2 minus 1 so 2 minus 1 it will be 1 so it would be 1k next I am putting the value p of 3 that is k x k jaga pe am value likhenge 3 minus 1 3 minus 1 that is 2 so this will be 2k same way we will do the next that is k and the value of x is 4 so p of 4 where the equation is given only k and here we don't have the x so we four ki value kahi nahi rakh sakte so we'll keep p of 4 as a k next for p of 5 this is the equation first i am keeping the equation by putting x 6 minus x then the x value will be converted into 5 so k 6 minus 5 so 6 minus 1 5 will be 1 so this will remain only k so out of this first of all we'll remove the value of k as the question is asked you that is sigma p of x equals to 1 but for that we'll add all of this p x value that is p of 2 p of 3 p of 4 p of 5 which would be equals to 1 so p of 2 is k p of 3 is 2k P of 4 is K, P of 5 is K. So, here P of 2 we have seen K, P of 3 was 2K, P of 4 was K and P of 5 was K equals to 1. So, 1 plus 2, 3, 3 plus 1, 4, 4 plus 1, 5. So, this is 5K equals to 1. Here we got the K value is 1 upon 5. So, after getting value we can convert it. That is here the k value which will be converted into 1 upon 5 that is the value just now we found if 2k is converted with the value the 2 will be as it is and the k value is 1 upon 5 so this will be 2 upon 5 next p of 4 where the value was only k we, if we will convert the k value with the original value which we found just now it will become 1 upon 5 same here it will convert into 1 upon 5 now the question is asking to find the variable x, assume even number. Now, the even number out of this is 2 and 4. So, therefore, first we'll write down what the question. Jo question me likha hai, wo hi copy karna hai. Variance x, assume even number. So, even number yaha par 2, 3, 4, 5 hai. So, even number hamare paas 2 or 4 hai. So, we'll take it p of 2 plus p of 4. Now we'll just take the value of p of 2. p of 2 ki value thi 1 upon 5. Plus p of 4 ki value hai this 1 upon 5. p of 4 ki value. Now here denominator is 5. So common number will be 5. 1 plus 1. It will become 2 upon 5. Hence. probability of variable x assume even number is 2 upon 5 here we complete the first question of section d moving to the next the probability distribution of a random variable x is as follow again the equation is given x value is given and the question asks that find the value of c and show them that p of 2 is equals to 3 p of minus 2. Now first of all x ki value minus 2, 1 and 2 diye. So we, uh, random variable maine yaha pe rakh diya hai. p of x 
by keeping the x value in this equation we'll find out so let's take this equation that is p of x equal to c now first we'll take the value of x as a minus 2 so c here i am keeping in bracket minus 2 plus minus 2 now c will be as it is minus minus will convert into plus and two twos are it will change into four now if the bracket will open plus minus will convert into minus then this value will come to c will be as it is four minus two that is two so this will be like two c next value that is p of one again we'll take this same situation but x ke jaga pe hum rakhenge one so one square plus one so here one ones are remain one plus one so one plus one it would be two c next p of two c will be as it is two square plus two c will be as it is two twos are four four plus two it would be six c so here we get all the value now out of this first we'll find out the value of c so don't keep directly in p of x we'll first find out that is sigma p of x equals to 1 here we'll take 2c here i'm taking the value 2c 2c 6c equals to 1 now 2 plus 2 plus 6 it would be 10c so here we got the value of c that is 1 upon 10. Now after getting the value, here we can keep the value that is 2 into 1 upon 10. Here also 2 will be as it is c key value rakhre, 1 upon 10. Here again 6 into 1 upon 10. So here the value will be 2 upon 10, 2 upon 10 and here 6 upon 10. Don't start cut. Up denominator as it is rakna just say hame yaha pe jab hame addition kare hamara answer correct aja 2 upon 10 2 upon 10 and here it is 6 upon 10 so here sigma p of x should be equals to 1 jaha pe denominator dekhe to submit 10 hi hai 2 plus 2 plus 6 it would be 10 so 10 can cut yes our answer is correct now the next thing what has been asked in the question that find the value of c wo humne dhoond liya so that p of 2 and 3 p of minus 2 is equal. Now for this first let's keep the equation. Here I kept p of 2 equals to 3 p of minus 2. Here p of 2 here is p of 2 is 6 10. So here I kept 6 upon 10. 3 will be as it is p of minus 2. p of minus 2 is 2 upon 10. So here this is 6 upon 10 but here also 3 2s are it would be 6 upon 10. So yes it is proved. So here we have written that hence it is proved that p of 2 is equals to 3 p of minus 2. The same say right? So here complete second. Next. The distribution of the random variable x is p of x k into 5 permutation x x ki value yahan par 0 se 5 tak di hai find the constant k and mean of the distribution now for this here you can see i already prepared with the tabulation where i can keep the value of random variable that is 0 1 2 3 4 and 5 now p of x will be written after solving this equation so first let's keep p of x equals to k this dot means a multiplication so i am putting this multiplication now first we will keep the value of x as 0 that is k will be as it is 5 p 0 that means it is k into the calculation will come 1 so here the answer is k moving next next value is 1 so now we will keep the value of x as a 1 5 p 1 which means k equals to if you remove the permutation of this will remain 5 so here the answer is 5 k next p of 2 
where we'll keep the k as it is 5 p 2 now if you remember permutation mein hum niche denominator nahi likhenge but 5 ko do digit piche lekar jayenge that is 5 and 4 so 5 four za become 20 and this k as it is next p of 3 where the k will be as it is 5 permutation Now here k will be as it is five को पांच digit पीछे लेकर जाएंगे denominator इसमें नहीं आता है combination में denominator आता है तो five four three five four is a twenty and twenty uh, into three will be sixty so here comes sixty k so k will be as it is five four थ्री टू नीचे फोर है तो पीछे चार डिजिट नीचे गए पीछे गए तो यहाँ तक का मल्टीप्लीकेशन वॉज सिक्सटी सिक्सटी इंटू टू विल बी वन ट्वेंटी के विल बी एज इट इज फाइव फोर थ्री टू वन सो दिस मल्टीप्लीकेशन इज अगेन वन ट्वेंटी के सो हियर वी सॉल्व ऑल द वैल्यू by keeping the value of x now here we can solve here i i'm going to solve that is sigma p of x equals to 1 where i'm going to put all the value or you can i can show you here that p of 0 p of 1 2 3 4 and 5 equals to 1 Now whatever we have found out of p of zero, we'll just keep the value of that k five k p of two is twenty k p of three sixty k p of four one twenty k and p of five again one twenty k equals to one. Now, if you add all this k, you will find it is three twenty six k equals to one. So your k value is one upon three twenty six. So here we got all the value. Now here again we'll convert it. The k value just now we found is one three twenty six. Next here five into five ke baad k hai aur k ki value three twenty six hai. So your value will be Five three twenty six. This will be converted into twenty into one upon three twenty six. So this will be twenty upon three twenty six. Same this sixty into one upon three twenty six. It would be sixty upon three twenty six. Here one twenty one upon three twenty six. Three twenty-six. So here we wrote all the value. Now let's write down here. Here the p of zero k ki value. I'm directly rectifying. Three twenty-six. P of one ke liye it is five three twenty-six. P of two ke liye it would be twenty upon three twenty-six. P of three ke liye value will be sixty upon three twenty-six. P of four one twenty divide by three twenty six. P of five is again one twenty upon three twenty six. Now here don't forget to give get the total should be one. So denominator up they can see that you have three twenty six here and take your calculator and add it up one plus five plus twenty plus sixty one twenty plus one twenty it would be three twenty six. So your value correct here. Now the question is actually asked. mean and what is mean that is x get multiply with p of x if zero get multiply with this obviously the answer will be zero 1 into 5 it would be 5 upon 326 2 into 20 40 upon 326 3 into 60 180 upon 326 4 into 120 that is 480 326 5 into 120 It is six hundred upon three twenty six. Here we get the total. That is sigma x p of x is denominator to three twenty six. Here aega. Ye numerator hi ap sare plus kar do. You will get one three zero five. 
so here we will give the answer for mean that is sigma x p of x just now we found is 1305 divided by 326 here we complete third question next in a game of hitting a target the probability that Ramesh will fail in hitting the target is 2 upon 5 now from such a long exercise हमें जब भी पढ़ा यहाँ पर हमेशा हमें probability of success ही दिया गया था पर ये एक सेंटेंस खुद बता रहा है कि probability which has been failed तो ये हम डिनोट करेंगे एज अ क्यू नाउ इफ ही इज गिवन थ्री ट्रायल्स टू हिट द टारगेट फाइंड द प्रोबेबिलिटी ऑफ द इवेंट दैट ही हिट्स द टारगेट सक्सेसफुली इन टू ट्रायल्स इफ यू रिमेंबर द नंबर ऑफ सक्सेस इज अवर एक्स तो ये एक्स हो गया और नंबर ऑफ ट्रायल दैट इज अवर एन so here we got q n and x so out of this we can obviously find out p as well so sabse pehle q ki value rakh lete hain that is 2 upon 5 and now we'll find out p p means 1 minus q where 1 will be as it is q value is 2 upon 5 now again we'll take the lcm for lcm we'll take the numerator 1 common number mein rahega 5 1 5 is 5 and 5 1 is 5 5 1 is 5 1, 2, 2, it is 3 upon 5. Always, there is actually don't need to solve. But agar yaha pa 2 upon 5 hai, to 2 mein se 5 minus kya, it would be 3 upon 5. Aise aap directly bhi kar sakte ho, but don't take a chance in board exam. Better you show them the solution. Then, n equals to 3 and x equals to 2. So here, what they ask to find out, that is, state the mean of the distribution and even after solving this, we'll solve the binomial distribution. Here I wrote the formula. Here the x value is 2. So p of 2 equals to n3. p value is 3 upon 5. Raise x that is 2. q value is 2 upon 5. Where n value is 3 and x is 2. Now here, descending order में 3, 2 जाएगा, क्योंकि ये combination है, हम नीचे भी denominator भी लिखते हैं, then this will be square, that is 3 into 3 and 5 into 5, here 3 minus 2 all will remain only once, so here 2 will get cut, the value will remain 3, here 3 3 is a 9 and 5 5 is a 25, this will remain as it is 2 upon 5, now 3 into 9 into 2, you will get 54 and numerator 20 uh, denominator 25 into 5 it is 125 now the question is also ask you the mean and mean means n p where the n value is 3 and p value is 3 upon 5 so here 3 3 is a 9 denominator 5 so that's how we completed question number 6